Hello and welcome to this video tutorial on how to locate hotspots on a semiconductor die using the OptoTherm Micro Thermal Imaging Microscope. This is our current setup, a complete micro system along with the standard laboratory DC power supply. Today I will be powering one of the diodes on a thermal test die in order to demonstrate how hotspots can be identified. For this demonstration, leads have been soldered to contacts on the bottom of the die package. How you make electrical contact with your device will depend on the configuration of your semiconductor package. I am using a DC power supply to power the diode. When connecting your device to a power supply, Connect the leads through the relay module so that power can be synchronized with the software hotspot test. For this demonstration, I will apply 1 volt and 100 milliamps to the diode. The voltage and current you will need to apply to your device will depend on its electrical specifications. Mount your device under the camera on the thermal stage. Set the thermal stage to a low temperature such as 40 degrees Celsius or 104 degrees Fahrenheit to provide adequate image contrast for focusing. Start the Thermalize Electronics Analysis software. To make focusing easier, press the Focus Mode button to disable image averaging. The camera is focused by manually adjusting the camera height. Unpress the Focus Mode button after the camera is focused. Open the hotspot detection window and set the test length. For this demonstration, I will use a test length of 5 seconds. Open the hotspot I.O. window and set the activate and deactivate times for the relays that you are using. Powering the diode requires only one relay and I will set the activate time to 0 seconds and the deactivate time to 5 seconds. These settings will activate the relay at the start of the test and it will remain activated throughout the remainder of the test. Start the hotspot test. The time remaining in the test is displayed below the start stop button. Press the Auto Scale button to automatically adjust the color palette to the current image. Adjust the image noise level until the hotspot is clearly defined. Display a picture of the device over the thermal image and adjust its transparency to locate the hotspot. This picture was automatically aligned with the thermal image earlier, but we will cover picture importing and alignment in another tutorial. Zoom in to precisely locate the hotspot. Draw a region enclosing the hotspot to display the temperature rise. This hotspot rose 0.62 degrees Celsius during the test.
Hot spots with much lower temperature rise can also be identified. We will cover these advanced hotspot tools such as test averaging and automatic hotspot identification in later tutorials. Thank you for watching and please visit our website if you would like more information about this product.